I think yung grief ay isa sa mga emotions, isa sa mga emotional responses na mahirap i-define talaga at mahirap isyang ikahon. Maraming tao ay hindi sanay na makaramdam ng ganun kalalim, ganun kabigat na mga emosyon at wala namang tamang panahon ng pag-grieve. Everyone grieves differently. May mga personal na um, journey, path ang bawat tao sa pag-grief so hindi natin siya pwedeng sabihin na isang strict timeline lang. Another way to look at grief, especially for us that have the Christian faith, is that grief is something that can be temporary. So may mga panahon na malungkot tayo, pero may mga panahon din na pwede tayong magkaroon ng hope. Especially since we believe that maybe this grief is temporary and we have something to look forward to. That our loved ones are in a better place, that the grief will also pass. So we can also have that faith, that spirituality to hold on to and to help us cope with the grief. So as cliche as it may sound, the easiest way out of grief is actually through it. Pinoproseso natin yung grief. Kailangan na nararamdaman natin yung grief. E mahalaga na harapin natin yung mga emotions na kasama sa pag-grieve. So we have to realize na hindi talaga siya fully na nawawala sa atin. So being able to really process that grief or get over grief is very difficult to define. Actually, the more that we run away from it, the more we deny it, mas napro-prolong ang grieving process. So it's really important for us to allow ourselves to just feel those feelings even though it's difficult. Difficult, little by little until we reach a place where we're okay. So in this time of grieving, I think mahalagang mag-turn din tayo sa Bible and makakita ng mga sources of comfort. I like looking at Ecclesiastes 3 verses 1 and also verse 4. So sinasabi doon ay, There is a time for everything and a season for every activity under the heavens. And if we jump to verse 4, sinasabi that there's a time to weep and a time to laugh, a time to mourn, and a time to dance. So ina-emphasize niya na hindi mali yung nararamdaman natin, na it's okay to feel sad, it's okay to mourn, it's okay to weep. The grieving that we're experiencing is something that is valid and real and true. And at the same time, it doesn't stop there. It can also pass and there are moments that we can laugh and dance again. Gusto rin natin i-remind yung mga tao that, you know, according to Psalm 34, 18, The Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those who are crushed in spirit. So when we feel like we can't handle it on our own anymore, we also have Christ to turn to, to help us as we weep, as we mourn, and as we grieve. <laughs>